you know, I'll talk to you about Michelin a little bit in terms of buyer centricity. Mm -hmm. Uh, When they got to North America in the 70s, you know, they wanted their tires, which were premium, to be only at certain locations, right? Because the location had to be clean. It had to be this. It had to be that. The experience was very important. Important. We only directed Michelin customers to those types of places. The 80s came around, the 90s came around, and these big companies that have been around for 100 years became buyer centric before us in automotive kind of knew what that meant. And that meant listening to the customer. And that meant, you know, having Michelin tires at Canadian Tire and Costco, having them in our mm-hmm. car dealership where the customer's already bringing their cars in. Becoming buyer centric is doing everything possible to make it easy for the customer to deal with our brand in a way that, you know, enriches their experience and in a way where we demonstrate value beyond our product. Uh, Nobody walks into an Apple store with the expectation of getting a grumpy face, right? So, you know, people in product go hand in hand. Becoming buyer centric means taking a look at the data. What are customers expecting? They're expecting speed. They're expecting answers. They want pricing. They want to know about your incentives. They want to see the car before coming in. Sometimes they don't want to come in. Sometimes they do. You have to read that data in order to formulate your responses and your follow-up strategies so that you sound like the customer wants you to sound finally. So Mm -hmm. becoming Mm -hmm. buyer-centric is taking ourselves out of the equation and how many things we have to book and deliver in this beyond the 30 days of our cycle in automotive and taking a look at our customer as our book of business How can we expand it? And really, honestly, how to expand that is through communication, it's through frequent follow-up, it's through value, it's through video, it's through generating exciting opportunities for the customer to participate in the dealership culture. So there's my spiel for you. 